All right, this question is the hardest question ever on the SATs. So the question is, if 3x minus y is equal to 12, what is the value of 8 to the x over 2 to the y? So there's a concept you have to understand first, and it's exponential rules. So what are the exponent, exponent rules? First, if you have x to the a times x to the b, what is this equal to? This will equal to x to the a plus b. You keep the same base and you just add the exponents. What if it's x to the a my, uh, divided by x to the b? That's just going to be x to the a minus b. And lastly, the third rule is x to the a to the b power. This is just equal to x to the a times b. So as long as you remember these three exponent rules, you should probably be good with any exponents question. So let's look at our question. 8 to the x over 2 to the y. Well, looking at the number 8, this can be rewritten as what? It can be rewritten as 2 to the third power, right? It's the same as 2 times 2 times 2. Well, now 8 to the x is basically the same as what? It's going to be 2 to the third 3x, right? 8 to the x, 2 to the 3x. We are going to use this rule right here over 2 to the y. Well, we technically have the same base, 2, and what does that mean? When we have the same base, we can just subtract our exponents, right? So this is equal to same base, 2, to the, subtract a minus b, 3x minus y, 3x minus y. Now we end up with 2 to the 3x minus y. What's the value of 3x minus y? Well, it's given by the question. It's going to be 2 to the 12, meaning your answer has to be Hey, so if you want to learn more SAT questions and are studying for the next SATs, make sure to check out my videos. This one is a tough one, and I'll see you in the next one.